Maine Coon cats are known for their impressive size, striking appearance, and friendly nature. However, before deciding to bring a Maine Coon cat into your home, it's important to consider the potential downsides and challenges that come with owning this breed. In this video, we will discuss 19 reasons why you may want to reconsider getting a Maine Coon cat as a pet. Understanding these points will help you make an informed decision about whether or not this breed is the right fit for you and your lifestyle. Number one, size and space requirements. Maine Coon cats are one of the largest domestic cat breeds, often weighing between 10 to 25 pounds. Their large size means they require more space compared to smaller cat breeds. If you live in a small apartment or have limited living space, Accommodating a Maine Coon size and activity levels may be challenging. Number two, grooming needs. Maine Coons have long, thick fur that requires regular grooming to prevent matting and tangling. Their coats need to be brushed at least once a week to keep them clean and free from knots. If you don't have the time or patience for regular grooming sessions, a Maine Coon may not be the right choice for you. Number three, shedding. While all cats shed to some extent, Maine Coons are known for their heavy shedding. Their dense fur can quickly cover your furniture, clothes, and carpets with hair. If you or anyone in your household has allergies or cannot tolerate excessive shedding, a Maine Coon may not be suitable. Number four, health issues. Like any breed, Maine Coons are prone to certain health problems, including hip dysplasia, heart disease, and polycystic kidney disease. These conditions can result in costly veterinary bills and require regular medical care. If you are not prepared for potential health issues or the associated expenses, it may be wise to consider a different breed. Number five, activity level. Maine Coons are highly active cats that require mental and physical stimulation to prevent boredom. They enjoy interactive play, climbing, and exploring their surroundings. If you have a sedentary lifestyle or limited time to devote to engaging with your pet, a Maine Coon's activity needs may be difficult to meet. Number six, buying a Maine Coon is expensive. Acquiring a Maine Coon cat can be expensive. The cost of purchasing a kitten from a reputable breeder can range from a few hundred to several thousand dollars. Additionally, you need to consider ongoing expenses such as food, veterinary care, grooming supplies, and toys. If you are on a tight budget, the financial commitment of owning a Maine Coon may be a burden. Number seven, training and socialization. Maine Coons are generally intelligent and trainable, but they require proper training and socialization from an early age. Without adequate training, they may develop undesirable behaviors such as scratching furniture or aggression. If you don't have the time or experience to train a cat effectively, a Maine Coon may not be the best choice. Number eight potential for destructiveness. Maine Coons have a playful and curious nature, which can sometimes lead to destructive behavior. They may knock over objects, scratch furniture, or engage in excessive climbing. If you have valuable or delicate items in your home that you are concerned about, a Maine Coon's natural instincts may pose a problem. Number nine, longevity. Maine Coons have an average lifespan of 12 to 15 years, which is shorter compared to some other cat breeds. If you are looking for a longer companionship with your feline friend, a breed with a longer lifespan might be a better choice. Number 10, Maine Coons are curious cats. Like many breeds of cats, Maine Coons have a high tendency to be very curious by nature. If you buy any new items for your home or go shopping, they will often be found sniffing and inspecting the bags, boxes, or packaging in case they find anything interesting. Around the home, you will often find them climbing into cardboard boxes, venturing under beds, or into cupboards. This may be one of the reasons cat-proofing some areas of the home becomes important. Number 11, they're expert hunters. Maine Coons are often accomplished hunters. 
This is actually normal, not naughty cat behavior. You can't really stop it, and you shouldn't punish one for doing it. Indoor cats don't get to hunt unless your house happens to be full of mice. So bear in mind this particular skill before buying a Maine Coon. Can you cope with having an accomplished hunter in your home? Number 12, personality quirks. While Maine Coons are generally friendly and sociable, they may have a few personality quirks that some owners find challenging. They are known for their excessive vocalization and may meow loudly and frequently. Number 13, food expenses. Maine Coons are big cats, so they'll eat a lot more than your regular cat. With an eight kilograms cat, you bet food's going to be more expensive. Most cat food companies are crassly misrepresenting cat dietary needs. Maine Coons need much more food than a regular cat. My advice is to feed your cat about 10 to 11 meals per day, with a few cat crackers per meal. Maine Coons need a lot of protein, so speak with your veterinarian when in doubt about the proportions. Number 14, they are kittens forever. Many owners love that Maine Coons retain a kitten-like love of play well into adulthood. Most cats grow out of their kitten phase, but Maine Coons seem perpetually fascinated by toys and other stimuli. This is an adorable quality that is usually listed as a positive trait of the breed. However, if you've ever raised kittens, you'll know that as adorable as they are, they're also a lot of work. Number 15, Maine Coon can develop separation anxiety. Separation anxiety can happen with kittens that grow up without you even realizing the condition. If you notice that your cat cannot be separated from you for long periods of time, this could indicate that they have separation anxiety. Whether it is severe or not, you'll find out by learning the circumstances. What you can do about this is provide your gentle giant with a lot of toys when you leave the house. If that doesn't work, then you can try restricting your cat to one place so it cannot cause mass until you come back. Number 16, risk of theft. One unfortunate downside about Maine Coons is that they are often the victims of theft. This is an expensive and highly coveted breed and criminals are likely to target pedigree cats to sell online. Number 17, Maine Coons need a lot of enrichment. One of the main reasons why Maine Coons end up being a poor choice of breed for certain owners is because they require a lot of enrichment. These intelligent cats can become bored by regular cat toys more easily and prefer activities that puzzle them and keep them thinking. If these cats don't get enough enrichment, their boredom can lead to destruction. Number 18, they need extra large cat towers. Maine Coons love to climb and explore, so a cat tree is a vital expense. Unfortunately, since Maine Coons are so large, a standard size cat tree simply won't work for them. You'll have to buy a larger, and therefore more expensive, cat tree to ensure your Maine Coons needs are being met. Number 19, they attach to one person. So we mentioned earlier that the fact that Maine Coons attach to one person, right, and although this is good for the person who they do, attach to, it's not always good for everyone else. See, it doesn't matter what others may do. Your Maine Coon will be friendly, they can be loving, but they will never really share as deep of a bond as with their chosen human. For me, this can be a negative, as I know how our Cody is with me. And it's kind of sad that he won't give others the same love, and they can't see him the way that I see him.